So what exactly is a colloid? In chemistry class, you're used to dissolving things in water. Well, the silver here in a colloid isn't actually dissolved in water. It's actually suspended in the water, and it's, the small particles stay suspended by thermal energy, and they move around by Brownian motion. When the size of the particles are large, they'll refract the light in a wavelength-independent manner, and you'll get white, like it's like a cloud. Uh, foggy, on a foggy day, you see it, it, it looks white. Or when you look at a cloud in the sky, it looks white because there's large particles. When there's smaller particles, it refracts light by Rayleigh scattering, and you get a wavelength-dependent diffraction, and that's why the color of these small 10 nanometer silver particles actually have a yellow, brownish, amber color to them.